Welcome to lesson 181, EFT Tapping with the Course in Miracles workbook. You can watch lesson one for a full overview of the description of what this all is. And uh, if you haven't, read the, there's a special introduction to this batch of lessons in the workbook. It might be a good refresher. We are definitely diving deep here and continuing with, I would say, some you know longer and more dense lessons here. So let's give ourselves a breath, get ready, settle in. Tapping on the side of the hand. Today's lesson is, I trust my brothers who are one with me. So, repeating after me. Even though I do not yet trust the others around me, I choose to have compassion for myself and open my mind to this lesson. I trust my brothers who are one with me. Even though I hold fears about losing my way, I choose to honor and accept where I'm at. Even though I do not perceive innocence all around me, I choose to accept myself as best I can and open my mind to this lesson. I trust my brothers who are one with me. Okay, through the points now. I trust my brothers who are one with me. Trusting your brothers is essential to establishing and holding up your faith and your ability to transcend doubt and lack of sure conviction in yourself. Perception has a focus. It is this that gives consistency to what you see. Change but this focus and what you behold will change accordingly. I choose to remove focus on your brother's sins and experience the peace that comes from faith in sinlessness. Today, we seek for innocence and nothing else. We seek for it with no concern but now. A major hazard to success has been involvement with your past and future goals. Noticing how different those goals are. from the goals of this course and allowing myself to relax any tension there. You have also been dismayed by the depressing and restricting thought that even if you should succeed, you will inevitably lose your way again. These concerns are but defenses against presence, present change of focus in perception. Today I choose to lay these pointless limitations by. A little while, at least. We recognize that we have lost this goal if anger blocks our way in any form. If a brother's sins occur to us 
and turn our eyes upon our own mistakes. which we will magnify and call our sins with instructions to our minds to change their focus. We say, it is not this that I would look upon. I trust my brothers who are one with me. I choose to use this thought to keep me safe throughout the day. I choose to not ask for fantasies. For what we seek to look upon is really there. And as our focus goes beyond mistakes, we will behold a holy, sinless world. The love he feels for us becomes our own. This will become the only thing we see, reflected in the world and in ourselves. Our love for everyone we look upon attests to our remembrance of the Holy Self. We seek for this remembrance as we turn our minds to practicing today. We look straight into the present. I'm allowing my mind to focus there. This instant is our willing one with his. Okay, take a breath. Mm. Okay, how did that go for you? Said a lot in these. Congratulations on, on staying with it this far. I look forward to seeing you on the next lesson. All right, take care.